when Snyder Cut was officially announced for HBO Max, my happiness was out of control. The hard work for years had finally paid off. The same hard work, which could have been used to do something useful in my life, was invested in cyberbullying a production company. Anyways, since the DC fandom event is on 22nd August, and we are getting the trailer for Snyder Cut, I knew this was the right time to make a video about it and hawk some views. And I thought, what kind of video can I make? Well, since we don't know much about what Zack Snyder had in his mind for Justice League, I thought it would be a great idea to tell my handful of viewers about my expectations from Snyder Cut and rant about all the blunders done in Joss Whedon's Justice League. So, here are my expectations from Zack Snyder's Justice League. First and foremost, it will be better. When Justice League was announced, we were promised something big, something iconic. But instead, we got just trying to be Avengers League. I hope I'm not disappointed this time. Number 2. Justice League was supposed to introduce the bigger parts of the DC Universe, like introducing Darkseid, the big baddie of DC Universe. Instead, we got nothing. There were no proper hints given to what is beyond the Earth. There was just puny little cameos by Green Lantern and things which didn't lead anywhere. So I hope they explore the universal scale of Justice League. Number 3. Give justice to Steppenwolf's character. In the movie, we were shown that he was the leader of everything, as if there was no one senior than him, which is not at all true to the comic origins. So that must be fixed about Steppenwolf. Also, Zack Snyder had some different designs for him, but personally, I'm okay with both the designs. Number 4. Make Superman's return from death a little more emotional. There needs to be a lot more character development there. Also, the final fight where Superman just shows up like he's all good and ready to vanquish the evil just seems so out of place. And yes, please, please give us the black suit Superman. It's been ages since Superman's theme hasn't changed. I don't see why Superman can't have a little dark theme. The fans have matured. It's time the heroes matured too. Number 5. I want some actors to be recast. But I don't think that's possible now. Hmm. So let's live with it. But acting can be developed. For example, don't make Flash to be like Spider-Man. Flash is Flash. He's a comedic relief, but he isn't a dumb teenager. He's a mature person. I hope Flash is improved. Same goes for Batman. Why is Batman cracking jokes? Don't do that. Batman is a serious character. I'm sure Snyder will improve that. Number 6. I want Green Lantern and Martian Manhunter to show up. There have been rumors about Martian Manhunter having a cameo in Justice League but was cut down by Whedon. The presence of Martians was even confirmed in the teaser given by Snyder. For Green Lanterns, I wouldn't mind if Ryan Reynolds returned. Give him a second chance. He gave justice to Deadpool. Maybe he can give justice to Green Lantern too. Only if he has the willpower to do it. Instead of Hal Jordan, if any other Lantern like Jon Stewart or Guy Gardner or anyone else would be cool too. But that's just my expectations. Who knows what could happen. Number 7. Fix the color palette for the final fight, god damn it! Who thought that orange is better than night blue? It just looks odd and is painful to the eyes. Number 8. I also hope they remove all the out of context comedy put in the movie. That was really unnecessary. That's a Joss Whedon trademark, if you guys don't know about it. Number 9. This, I know won't happen, but I'm still saying. Change the suit for Flash. It doesn't look good at all. Also, Cyborg's design can be changed. Cyborg is supposed to be a heavy duty machine and in the Justice League he just gives out an Iron Man suit kind of vibe. This may not be covered in the Snyder Cut but can be improved in the future movies. That is if they happen. And now the last point. I hope we get to see some more informative post credit scenes. I know the DC Extended Universe is already doomed but I still wanna see the original post credit. So these were my expectations from the Snyder Cut. I hope the Snyder Cut meets them all. Tell us what your expectations are in the comments below. Thanks for sticking till the end. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe. In the meantime, I'll find another production house to cyber bully. Bye bye.